Hey everyone, just wanted to make a video about what tricks Porter can do. It's a rainy day, it's supposed to be rainy for seven days straight apparently. Uh, so yeah, one of the best things you can do when you're having a boring day is do some treat training, or just in his case, not really training, just he already knows how to do his tricks. <laughs> Step one. Get rid of all the distractions, a.k.a. the cats. So step two is finding a treat that they like. He didn't like any dog treats when I first got him. Uh, still doesn't. I just used chicken, especially when you're first starting their training. Uh, these days I just use these cat treats, Temptations. They're small, and it really helps with chihuahuas. They're tiny little mouths. The current tricks he can do. Sit. Good boy. He can do shake. <laughs> it's already good. Good boy. He can do higher shake. <laughs> good boy. Go oh boy. <laughs> he can do what I call go away. And come back. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. So yeah, let's go into how I taught him. So for sit, I just did the kind of typical method where you hold your hold a treat in your hand and make him wait. Once he starts sitting down, the moment he does, you praise him and give him the treat. It took about a month. It was his first trick. He was kind of a bad shelter dog. Uh, yeah, it was really frustrating. Good boy. Good boy, Porter. <laughs> now, obviously, no problem. Um, one thing I do with the Chihuahuas is, because there are two of them, and they don't always listen if you tell them to do something because you know the diffusion of responsibility or whatever uh, as I point at them so I say <laughs> and he sits good boy if I do that to Polly she'll also sit you good boy good boy <laughs> so once you get them to sit once I got him to sit uh, the next thing you do is to make them wait this really makes them focus on what you want them to do. Good boy. Here, good boy, Porter. <laughs> yeah. So his next trick is, I guess, whatever you call it, the, uh, the shake. It's kind of, it's not really a shake with him. Come here. Shake. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. Uh, for this, I would, I basically, I had the weekend to myself, just me and him. Uh, hi, I know. <laughs> I didn't know where the treats were for a second. Uh, my wife was out of town, Polly was out of town with her, so we just had the whole weekend to work on this trick, and that's all it took was that one weekend. Good boy. But with that, with him, what I did was I just would grab his paw and say, shake. And I did that just repeatedly, <laughs> just for like, just a million times until he figured it out on his own. And yeah, that worked. It was not actually that hard. Good boy. Uh, so the modification to that is, of course, the, the high five. Hey, bud. He's not going to do it now. Hey, Bo. Good boy! Good boy, Porter! For that, I just held the treat in my hand higher. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Good boy. We just, once he got used to the low one, just did it higher. Yeah, good boy. <laughs> or, what I'm doing now, keep that one high, give him the treat with that hand. Good boy. Good boy, boy. 
So his next trick I call go away. Oh. <laughs> uh, this is useful for, you know, you want him to, you're working on a project and you don't want him to jump all over it or, you know, whatever the case may be. I have found this quite useful. Um, the, the nice thing to teach them when you do teach them this is come back. Uh, which I will demonstrate here. Come here, Good boy. Good boy. Okay, go away. He does not like to go away, of course. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> and for this one, what I would do is basically just not give him a treat, and I would say, everyone's well, just say, go away. <laughs> and when he would go away, I would walk over to him and praise him and give him a treat. Good boy. Yeah. The the come here, pretty standard. Uh, it was really necessary for him because he did not like to listen when we first got him. Absolutely the worst listener I've ever, <laughs> of any dog I've ever owned. Good boy. Very crucial. I We did a lot of training outside where I would just say, come here. Good boy. And give him a treat. Um, just repetition with that. That's all that took. Okay, go away. Go away. Come here. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy, Porter. As you can see, training time is over. <laughs> Porter was tired out. <laughs> He's taking a little siesta. The cats have returned. <laughs> uh, let me know in the comments what tricks your dogs do. Maybe if you have a suggestion for what I should teach Porter. I haven't really been inspired to teach him anything new in a while, so, you know, it would be kind of fun. And yeah, thanks for watching.